Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I'm going to be working on a piece that I found on Facebook Marketplace for $10. It was quite a steal and I thought it would be perfect to redo for my daughter McKinley's room. So I'm going to go ahead and remove all of the hardware and then go ahead and use the TSP to remove any kind of grime on the piece of furniture. And then I'm going to be using the Rust-Oleum Chalked in Country Gray as well as the wax following the paint job. So as you can see here, I'm just going to go ahead and apply the paint. I do this all over and then I remove the drawers and paint the drawers separately. And you'll see that in the next few clips here. And with my brush strokes, I just kind of go back and forth um, in this same direction. Um, and I do that as well for the drawers. But using chalk paint is quite simple and that's why I do it. Um, I usually typically do two coats, so it doesn't take that long to dry. Uh, after the two coats, I then apply the wax after a couple hours and it's finished usually, so I can move it right away, which I love. In this next clip, I'll be showing you guys the drawers and what they look like prior to painting. And then in the next one, it's going to be one coat of paint. And this goes for the dresser as well. And then I went ahead and applied the second coat. So you can see there's a lot more coverage. And I did the same for the drawers. And then I'm going to go ahead and apply the wax. It's really quite simple. I just use this little towel and um, I try to just go in that back and forth motion. Sometimes I do circular motion, but I just make sure I cover um, all the areas on the surface. Um, and also the sides and little crevices that I can find. Um, and please excuse all the crap in my garage. I just had a garage sale recently, so everything is just piling up in the background. So next I'm moving on to the drawers and applying that wax. Again, please excuse all the mess behind me. Um, but then after I apply the wax, I let it dry and I move on to installing all the hardware back on. I typically never repaint over the hardware when I buy these pieces. I usually like the way they look, um, kind of old and rustic. So I just keep them as is. So here is the hardware all attached and I'm going to go ahead and insert those drawers once I take it upstairs and here's the before and here's the after. So I love the way this turned out. I didn't end up doing any wet distress on it. I liked it just in the solid gray um, and I love the way that it turned out. So I will definitely be doing more pieces like this in the future. Thanks again for watching this video. Please make sure to hit the thumbs up button below to like this video. Subscribe and hit the bell for more future videos to come and have a beautiful day. Thank you.